Oh, check out the old Zolneric store, folks. The old Zolneric local fuel prices in the picker hood, 362 a gallon for gasoline. Let's see what we got for some diesel, 373. We're off garage sailing, ski today. Friday garage sailing day. Bacon burger right there. Grab an egg white delight. Hiring. Part time hiring, folks. Yep, we're off garage sailing. There's Jules. There goes the Jules truck. They're gonna go pick up some garbage and we're gonna go pick up some garage sale treasures. Oh, yeah. Well, folks, I haven't hit one garage sale yet. Just been picking up free shit. Look at that. Another TV. Alright guys, this got done picking up. Oh look at that car, it's my car boys. My car, what, what's it doing sitting there? Holy shit ski. Just got done picking up that weed whipper out of the trash. Now I'm gonna go up here to this garage sale. It's supposed to be right up the freaking street. Hopefully we find some more garbage on the way. That's what I'm talking about. We gotta make the money before we spend it. That was told anyway. Holy shit, that looks like a big one folks. We need to hurry up and get up there. I can see it, I can see it hitting the streets from here. Holy shit ski. Hopefully they got a bunch of Nintendo games. Hopefully they got tables full of Nintendo shit. That's what we're hoping for this morning. There's already a shit ton of people there as you could freaking tell, as you could tell. Yep, we gotta go hit this sale up ski. Get us some deals. Look at them all. All the deals. Holy shit. We gotta get up there. All the way out to the road. Look at that. Holy shit, that was a big ass sale, folks. Big ass freaking sale. Oh yeah, now I gotta get on to the next one. They had all kinds of shit there. Bunch of old stuff. Little bit old for me, folks. A little bit freaking old. That's what we get anyway. Big ass freaking garage sale, as you could tell. Now we're on to the next one. On to the next one. Look at all this shit, boys. Got me a printer and everything. Big ass brass lamp. Oh yeah. All right, guys, first freaking garage sales up it's right here. Oh, yeah, Saturday garage sale and day, first garage sale up. Let's check her out. Holy shit, ski, holy shit. There's the white van, boys, they gotta get up there. Oh, doing a little bit of garage sale, boys. Look what I found me this morning. A little vacuum, a little vacuum. Oh, yeah, we'll take that. Hoover. Oh, the competition is out today, folks. Look at the big ass garage sale. I gotta go to and get to shopping. Gotta get to shopping. Saturday fuel prices, folks. Saturday's fuel prices went down a little bit from yesterday. Oh, yeah. Holy shit, folks. Everybody's already there. They look at the competition today. Got a few cars out. Jeeps there. It looks like ski. We gotta get up there and see if we can get some deals. Somebody got some golf club skis, did they? Oh, he's gonna go golfing. Yep, we gotta get up to this freaking sale. They got all kinds of shit out there. Alright guys, my garage sale finds video. All the shit I've been picking up for the past two weekends. All video game related, most of it. Got a rear NES TV right there. I'll show you in a minute. Ski. It's worth quite a bit of money. Picked it up for pretty cheap. First pickup I had was this PS3 for 70 bucks. Not a bad deal. It's 160 gigabyte. Saved a little bit of money on that beast. If I ever sold it, I'd probably try to sell it for like a hundred. Got this thing for fifteen bucks. Game Boy Advanced with games and crap. Got a Game Boy Advanced SP in here. That's what it says, ski anyway. Silver edition. We got the silver model there, folks. We got a bunch of games in here with some with manuals. Got the manual for Super Mario Brothers 3, the Namco Museum game, SSX Tricky. Got all them games in here. Didn't really get no uh, good ones, but no Pokemon games in there, folks. Star Wars, Small Soldiers. The best one probably be the Mario, I'm guessing. Super Mario Brothers, Sonic Balls. Oh, Sonic Battle, SSX3, Let's see what else we get, I think there's like three, four more in here, yep, built the video game collection up a little bit these past two weeks, folks, there's the Namco Museum, Monkey Ball Jr., 
Oh, Girl What Up Nickelodeon and Lizzie McGuire. Those are the games that come with that for 15 bucks. I got all that stuff. Oh, yeah, we're rocking big times. $3, I got this Sony PS1. The PS3 come with two controllers. Got a PS1 with uh, cool borders for It's the slim model. Three bucks come with the manual and everything. Oh, yeah, that's a good deal. 50 cents a DVD. Guy had a whole shitload of them. I just got a couple out of the thing. Found a PS2 game in there. Alien vs. Predator. And Wolf Creek Ski. 30 bucks. I got me a new telephone. Check that beast out. She's huge. Big ass telephone, folks. Get that out of the package so you can see it. Comes with two cases, all the chargers. I just need to get a SIM card. I'm going to go up to Walmart and get a straight talk. Straight talk SIM card, then I'll have me a badass cell phone ski. Verizon LG. Pretty sweet. Got a camera in there. Got me some sunglasses. John Daly or some shit. Not too familiar with those. They're only a dollar. Only a buck, folks. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet sunglasses. For a dollar, I got a pair of Dwayne Wade Converse shoes. They're pretty freaking cool. A little bit dirty on the bottom. I'll clean those right up. Some of his shoes could sell for a lot of money. Number eight on the side. We'll put those down there. Get right into the rest of this stuff. Dollar, I got me a copy of The Shining. Two bucks for the season right there, Californication. Five bucks a piece for these PS3 games at the same sale. I got the PS3. Talked them down two bucks a piece. Pretty good freaking deal. Five bucks each. Needed some games to play with the Beast. Already got a copy of that. Homefront. Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. Medal of Honor. Yep, we got all those. The PS3 cost me 100 bucks skis. Holy shit. 60 bucks I got this beast. PSP. It's got a little case for it. Got a shit ton of games for 60 bucks. We'll go through these beasts. I don't think there's anything special in here. End War, Call of Duty. MX vs. ATV, Medal of Honor, Heroes, Twisted Metal. Pretty good game, Twisted Metal. Wipeout, Smackdown vs. Raw, Star Wars. Might be a pretty good one. SOCOM, Juice 2, and a football game, Ski. I got chargers and shit for the wall. Got two action figures out of the free box. Got me a Two-Face from Batman. Pretty sweet, and I got me a Ghostbuster. Then I paid a dollar for this big ass thing. Green Goblin from Spider-Man. Then we got uh, X-Files figures here. Two different versions of the Scully and Mulder there. Got me a Pepsi hat for like a quarter or some shit. It's an older one. Dollar for the Red Wings. Dollar for the Red Wings. Paid three bucks for these Wrangler jeans. They're brand new. Still got the tags on them and everything. Look at that, folks. Brand new pair of jeans for three bucks. Can't beat that. Got me an Annoying Orange t-shirt. He's on YouTube. Type in Annoying Orange. Paid a dollar for this beast. Gotta support the YouTubers. Oh, yeah. Anything I see that's YouTube related, I try to pick it up. Got me an ACDC t-shirt. Thunderstruck. For a quarter. Pretty good freaking deal there. Got me a Michigan Nike shirt for a dollar. It's a pretty fat ass shirt. Sweatshirt anyway. I'll wear that to the derby or some shit. Got me this for eight bucks. Brand new. Sony DVD player. It's so new that the batteries and shit are still wrapped in the original plastic. Oh yeah, we got a heck of a deal on this beast. Bunch of Sony shit this week. Bunch of shit from the Sonys. Got me some free Lego magazines. Couple of them beast. I got an old box full of them. I only grabbed a couple. How the Grinch sold Christmas book. Probably like 50 cents or some shit. 
three dollars I got this poker game it's not that bad whole shitload of people can play at once TV poker I got two of them this week I'll show you the other one here in a minute I'll be making it to that I got me this Harley bag for two bucks it's pretty freaking sweet I got that at the same spot I got my PSP pretty freaking nice ass bag you know them are expensive as shit expensive ass bags folks yep got me the Harley bag five bucks I got me a Wii charging system here got me the remote for my Mario Kart game for three dollars infinity for Xbox 360 cost me 15 bucks got all the figures and shit in there five bucks a piece for these two games Mario Sports Mix Mario Strikers Charged quarter for that dollar for that I paid like a dollar or two for these freaking games GameCube got a sports game there Hello Kitty game for the kid and for a dollar I got me snatched unopened Cartman he was a buck he was a buck folks got me this badass lot of stuff right here PlayStation 2 they wanted a dollar a game 25 bucks for the system five bucks for Guitar Hero and five bucks for the dance I just got it all for 50 gave him 50 bucks folks I got a whole shitload of games in there as you could freaking tell Dance Dance Revolution Frogger Spongebob Star Wars Burnout ATV Tony Hawk Underground 2 I like that game it's got BAM ski in it oh yeah it's got BAM and the Tony Hawk Underground's 2 we got Underground 1 I got two controllers there's two memory cards in there silver PlayStation 2 take that out and put it up there got another copy of Battlefront I got like three copies of that now Lord of the Rings, Shark Tales, I got two PSP games here and there. Dave Mira, BMX Challenge, Sean White Snowboarding, Star Wars Battlefront 2, bunch of badass games in good shape. We got a Top Gun, Combat Racing over there. Oh yeah, a whole shit ton of games there. Then I went to the local thrift store, picked up even more freaking games. Got the biggest loser for a buck. And I ended up getting like 450 off somehow. I don't know. Maybe they had a sale or some shit. Who in the frig knows? They're all PlayStation 1 games. 10 Pin Alley, that's a pretty good one. Spin Jam Puzzled. Jungle Book. Bunch of card game games and shit. Pong. They were Karens, folks. Should have taken them up to the thrift store. Wheel of Fortune. Mr. Domino. Devil Dice. Pro Pinball. Wally. -E. And I got another copy of Guitar Hero 2. I got like four copies of that beast. And I picked this up at the thrift store. It's a Grave Digger monster truck of some sorts. Got all kinds of buttons you can push. Make flames roll in the back. Looks like flames are rolling. You put the window down. It's got a little skull in there. Oh yeah, the kids love that beast. And then you hit a button and it actually starts going and shit. Then we got this for a buck. Monster Energy Ricky Carmichael hat. It's pretty sweet. Got all these for a dollar a piece at the same spot. I got the PS2. That's where I got all these games and movies. Incredible Hawk Returns, double disc. And then I got all these Wii games, buck a piece. Sims 2 Castaway. Tiger Woods PGA Tour. Hannah Montana. Need for Speed Pro Street. Oh yeah, what else did I get there? I got that Detroit hat there. Oh yeah. See, we got this Wii system cost me uh, 45 bucks. It's got two remote controls in there. One's a off-brand, not Nintendo. This one's a Nintendo Wii one. 
Got a little microphone. Got one joystick down or nunchuck. Got the gun and the Wii, 45 bucks. Not the best steel ski in the world, but we took it anyway. Ski, three bucks. We got a glove, baseball glove, Franklin. Pretty sweet. Pretty freaking sweet. Got me a Techno Bowl for 25 cents. These games, hold on, we'll go with these. Got me some old ass cap guns. Made of metal and shit. They don't make them like that anymore, folks. They do not make them like that. Old ass cap guns right there. 50 cents a pop. Those are pretty nice. But uh, at the same place I got my Nintendo TV here. I got all these games. Sonic Heroes, two bucks. Mortal Kombat, two dollars. Dollar for this PlayStation 1 game. Real Fishing, a buck. It was a pretty fun game. I like that one. I got this with the Xbox over there for five bucks. Five bucks for the Xbox, two controllers, and a game. It's pretty good. The Xbox kind of coming apart, though. Got me some Pokemon toys here for a dollar. Some kind of battle set or some shit. Uh, for a quarter, I got this Star Wars Force book. It must have had another freaking garage sale. Pokemon guy diamond version pearl version 50 cents not bad not bad sonic blast 50 cents plug and play got this brand new remote control car right here three dollars three bucks up there was 30 was 30 bucks at Kmart I was gonna open it up but I noticed that when I did the freaking batteries were still wrapped in plastic in there. Holy shit, let's get this beast open. Ah, screw it. The batteries are still wrapped in plastic, just like the DVD. Everything's still in there. Three bucks, you can't beat that price. Got me a little Mario thing for like a quarter. Got them out of the quarter box. Put the remote control car up there. Got me a DS game for two bucks. Harry Potter, pretty much every video game you're going to ever want to see right here, folks. I got me this video game TV made by Sharp back in the 80s or some shit. Cost me 10 bucks. It's really rare, I guess. They got one on eBay right now. The lowest one's 500 bucks, and the highest one's like $1,000. But I turn it on, works pretty good. Works pretty freaking good. And then you turn your Nintendo on down here. Boom. You play whatever you want. I got two of the original controllers. Oh yeah. We got uh, some baseball game playing now. Yep, we got a Nintendo here. Nintendo TV, rare one, sharp. It's pretty freaking sweet. Show you the back here in a second. And then it come with two games for ten bucks or three games actually. I got the TV, two controllers, and three games for ten bucks. Well, I'm guessing three hundred bucks I can get for that TV. Hoping three hundred bucks, folks. Then I got me this uh, Xbox. It was like forty bucks or some shit. I got a bunch of games with it. Bunch of freaking games with this Xbox for forty bucks. I got these ones down here too. All this shit come with it. Wondered where that was. Got me a Wheel of Fortune spinner. That. All these games in here. It even comes with a little hard case. All for 40 bucks. Plus I got some other shit too. Top spin. Unreal 2. Nobody really buys Xboxes. Not really worth a lot of money. I'm figuring some of these games might be worth something. Got a Batman. Hulk. Fable for computer, it looks like. Skate Adventure for PlayStation 2. Red Dead Revolver. Tech something. Legends of Wrestling. Football. Halo 2. 
Fallout 2 Sims. Some of them got writing on them. Brute Force. Pro Fishing. Dave Mira 2. Flat Out. Lynx 2004. Doom 3. 50 Cents Bulletproof. Fable. They were all at, got them all from the game store in the mall. Chaotic. Chaotic games in the mall, folks. We got Gauntlet, Dark Legacy there. Prince of Persia. Who in the frig knows? Star Wars Knights. Bruce Lee Quest the Dragon. Magic. Kung Fu Chaos. Armed and Dangerous. And Serious Sam. Then we got the freaking Xbox there. Two controllers. Hard case. Got another Xbox there that I got the last sale for five bucks. Ended up purchasing all this shit at another sale. This was like a dollar or some shit. One buck. That was a pretty good freaking deal right there. Show you what I got here. Game Boy Color. Still has the back and shit for the batteries. A bunch of just regular games. No Pokemons. No freaking Pokemons in here. We got Snoopy. Snoopy's Tennis. Missile Command. Jimmy Neutron. I'm always asking if they have more games. That's what I did with that TV. I didn't even notice it at first. It looked like a TV sitting on top of a VCR or some shit. But it ended up being a Nintendo TV. Star Wars Episode 1 Racer. Frogger. Crash Bash for a buck. Well, we needed that. I ended up picking up this little Leap Stir learning system for a dollar. Could have had so much shit, but I was didn't want to spend up my money. I want to save some for next week's ski. Three bucks for that thing. Three bucks for Spyro. I thought they were going to be some good games, but they ain't worth that much. And I paid 25 cents a piece for these beasts. Three Thai Beanie Babies, Elvin and the Chipmunks. Pretty freaking sweet. Yep, we got the Elvin and the Chipmunks. We got this for two bucks. Dale Earnhardt Jr. Amped Energy Sweatshirt. Good shape. Same sale for 10 bucks. Got me a GameCube. No game in there. 10 bucks for the silver GameCube. Power stuff's there. They had a bunch of PlayStation 1 games. Still got one that's still sealed for a quarter. Shrek for a quarter. Smackdown something for a quarter. NCAA Game Breaker 2001, Dr. Seuss's The Cat in the Hat for a quarter, and WCW Backstage Assault for a quarter. Got me this for free. Somebody that watches the, watches the YouTube show gave it to me. Or I don't know, I might have to pay him some money. I haven't really talked to him about that yet. It's got Donkey Kong in there and the Super Nintendo. We'll see the price on that as soon as I talk to the guy again. I see him garage sailing like every week, ski. Oh yeah, for a buck. Got this Pokemon Pie tin. There's actually a Thomas the Train one I should have got too, but I left that behind. We got Pokemon for my kid's birthday party, folks. For $2, I got this Disney Monopoly game. Pretty freaking sweet. It's got eight pewter tokens in there. Oh yeah, we got the Disney Monopoly. Then I got a bunch of other shit, some free uh, Sony shit in here. One's a receiver and one's a tape player or some shit. There's my guitar. Got the dance pad for the Dance Revolution. Got me a couple pool sticks. One was a dollar, the other two seventy-five cents. They're uh, Brunswick's. Some shit. This one's like. Got aluminum or some shit on the end, copper or aluminum. Goes all the way halfway up the stick. Pretty freaking sweet.
I'm gonna pull all this shit down show you this stuff real quick got me a Polaroid camera brand new in the box for a buck pretty freaking cool find lots of old shit like that around here garage is full of old shit we got uh, some jewelry for a dollar nothing spectacular in there DS game for a buck NBA Live for a dollar Ferrari model for a buck for five bucks I got these two broken Xbox systems one still got a hard drive so I'm gonna try to fix them up they got the power cords down in there the AV cables all the instruction manuals well, that's for Elite I got a couple instruction manuals in there all for five bucks three dollars I got me some scrap metals bunch of freaking wire sickies in here hoping I can uh that was two dollars that one was three hoping I can take all this wire and at least make a couple bucks make a couple dollars of my money back got a little shit ton down in there Going through this shit real quick ski got some adapter ends foreign travel adapters thing could come in handy boys in case I go traveling different countries take different sockets for their shit then we got all this shit down in here bunch of freaking wires random ass phone cables big buster box right there it's like a light system of some sorts yep bunch of random ass shit I always pick boxes like that up in there you never know what you're gonna find I'm gonna pull all this shit out I got a $10 DVD player right there. Still got the box, no remote. Doesn't work the best, but whatever. Whatever, Ski. I'll show you the rest of the shit I got. As soon as I get some of this cleaned up, I'll get it. Get them two receivers out of the box down there. Go around here, show you what I got. Went to a half off estate sale. Picked up this Kirby vacuum. It was $15, so I got it for $7.50. It's a Kirby Classic or some shit. Nice bag. I got all the attachments. Still in the original Kirby boxes. Pretty freaking sweet. Oh yeah, seven dollars. Then I uh, picked up this stand for twenty-five bucks. Pretty freaking sweet. It's a curio cabinet. It's got a door right there. Three sh shelf unit. Bam. Got a little light in there and shit. But I'll uh, clear off one of these tables, show you what I got in these two boxes. Then we'll probably check out the fireworks and some other random ass shit. Alright guys, here's my free Sony stereo equipment I got at a garage sale this week. I got a tape deck here. Tape player don't freaking close. I don't even know if the stuff works. And then I got a free uh, receiver ski here. Pretty freaking old. Bunch of freaking digital keypad buttons and then I got a remote for it still in the freaking box pretty freaking nice free oh yeah we love that kind then I got this TV for free at a uh, the garage sale I got my Nintendo TV guy said he had a free TV for me ski look at that DVD player in the side it's broken got like a crack or some shit right here right there there's a freaking crack folks We'll check out this Nintendo TV and then we'll go check out the fireworks I taped this year and some other random ass shit. Show you guys this beast. My controller is on the floor for some freaking reason. Game television controller. These controllers are rare, so is the remote for it. I don't think any of them have the box. Who knows? There might be one box out there. This TV's broken, it's missing the uh, flap here. Still got the flap there. Game television, they're sold at Sears and Kmart or some shit. Different models have different amounts. There's only 200 of one, and somewhere only like displays and shit. I'm not too sure exactly how many are out there. Not too many of these beasts. Not too many left. We got Nintendo. 
copyright 1986 Nintendo Entertainment System products. This is not a toy and is intended for use under adult supervision, boys. We got a little problem right there in the back. It's busted up a little bit. Brings down the value of her. Holy shit. January 1990, 19SV111. It's the model number, sharp. Yep, somebody commented under one of my videos said if I ever found a Nintendo TV, they wanted to buy it, but not ready to sell her yet, boys. Can't sell this beast yet. We gotta build up an ultimate video game collection. Keep up with the ABGN and Pat the NES Punk. And uh, CJR, he's got a shit ton of games too. Yep, this is a badass TV to add to your collection. Try to find one. Nintendo Television. John the Picker out. We're gonna go check out some fireworks or some shit. Alright, guys, problem of the day with these Xboxes that I got. Both of them got the red ring of death. Three uh, lights lit up, so we're gonna try to fix that problem. This one's got a silver front, this other one's got a white plug this one in real quick show you that that's the arcade model I believe so we'll uh, plug this in I'll show you the red ring of death on that and then I'll try to fix the beast alright now I got the arcade model plugged in we'll show you this one pretty much the same friggin problem now it's gonna blink to three yep I'm gonna try to fix that beast up real quick see what we get all right, folks, she's a rainy day at the strawberry patch today, as you could tell, as you could tell. One of the only ones here. We got two carriers of strawberries picked. 641 we got here at 6. We need to get a couple more. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, strawberry count. Look at all the freaking quarts I picked today. Holy shit, over 80. Oh, yeah. Then I got some back here. Now it's time to go sell these beasts. Show you what we get when we get our money. Oh, yeah. Some... Cavin dishes or some shit. Who knows? Who the frig knows? All right, guys, we got the berries sold. We turned a hundred and almost two hundred dollars into four hundred dollars. Look at that, folks. Look at that. Got a little bit more than four hundred, almost five. I had to pay for quart containers and stuff. We gotta go do the same thing tomorrow. Let's see what we can get then. Oh yeah. All right, guys, berry picking day two. Got about ten carriers already. It's about ten thirty. Ski in the morning. There's the rose, everybody's picking over there. Everybody's over there today. A few cars, skis. A few people picking the berries, more competition. Ski, look at them all. Holy shit. Holy shit. Didn't even notice them all in there, did we? Close up view of the action. Strawberry picking day two. John the Picker's gonna get back out there, show you what we got in the end. Got another field ski over there. And then he's got one ground up on the other side of that one. Over there somewhere. Yep, bunch of crap happening here. A few fields. It's a big ass one right there. Alright guys, Wednesday's strawberry haul. The strawberries I freaking got today. Not too bad, not too bad. Now I gotta go sell these beasts. Oh yeah! Quick look at them ski. Not bad berries. Now we gotta go make some money. Alright, guys, took $200 and doubled it into over $400 again today. Look at that beast. Yep, got my money back plus some. Um, now I need to go do it again. Yep, day three is coming up. Yep. Well, we gotta get those. Where I've been spending my days, folks. Oh yeah, I've been spending my days up at the Walmart. Strawberries, three bucks a quart. Better go come get some, folks. Better come get some. Oh, look at that, boys. It's the Will Work for Food Guys hiding spot. Got a bunch of, you got a bottle of water right there. Some baggies, probably doing some druggies. Some trash littering up big time. Good at all. Bunch of garbage there, and then it's stretched out down to here. 
All right, guys, my funds after day three. Got a few hundred dollars in here. Made about $30 less today than I did the first two days. But that's all right. Ski, we done doubled our money again today. Add that stack with that stack. We got some cash, boys. Look at that. Holy shit, ski. 20s and 5s and 1s and what have you. Got a bunch of 20s here. Oh, yeah, picking berries, boys. Bunch of 1s. Oh, shit, load of 1s. Yep. Made about six, seven hundred dollars so far. Need to keep on picking on. Heck yeah. Lots of money at John the Pickers Palace. A bunch of freaking checks and shit in the house. Yep, making up the cash big times picking strawberries. Oh yeah. Oh look boys, it's a ramp for Ken Block to jump. Holy shit. He can jump the ferry that goes underneath the bridge there. That'd be pretty freaking cool. Yep, big ass ramp. Anybody wants to hit that beast? Going on today. Oh, here we go. Alright guys, we got Kijiji'd this week. Kijiji'd, holy shit ski. We uh, went to check out this 98 Buick Century Limited for $400, drives it home. Not a bad freaking car. Went there with 400 bucks, the guy wouldn't freaking sell it to me. Holy shit ski. Yep, I took him $400, wouldn't freaking sell the car. Says he's going to be getting hold of me later on a day. Maybe he'll sell it today, he says. Holy shit ski. <laughs> Took him $400 cash. He wouldn't freaking sell me the car. Started out at 3.30 because of the exhaust is hanging and it's got a big dent in the side and a cracked windshield and the leather seats are all cracked up. So I started out at 3.30. He said he wasn't dropping down below 400 so I said I'll give you $400. I'll take it home right now. Guy says nope. Gotta wait till tomorrow. He's gotta take her drive her around and crap. Holy shit. Yep, I tried to get that car off Craigslist. Guy wouldn't sell it to me. $400 cash I took him. That's what he wanted. Hopefully he calls today. He said, we're, said he's going to sell it to me today, folks. Said he's going to sell it to me today. So we'll have to see if I got this car. If not, then we got Kijiji'd.